Today, we're gonna to be focusing on efficient vowels. And specifically, we're gonna be practicing the three things that will get you efficient vowels. First, let's focus on the forward tongue. It's gonna be the mm sound as in singing, okay? So we're not gonna waste any time. We're gonna jump right into singing an mm sound. Okay. So first things first, we're going to do an NG sound on this pitch. Let's see. We're going to do it wherever it feels comfortable. If that's higher, go for it. If it's lower, go for that. It's important that you bias your own comfort here because this scale is going to go pretty darn high. All the while, through this exercise, you're going to need to focus on keeping the tongue forward, but also wide. So when you're making the NG sound, mm, can you chew on your tongue a little bit? Gently, obviously. But if you can't, that means your tongue is narrow and you want a wide tongue. So let's take some time just on that note real fast. You can join me in that octave, or you can stay on the pitch. But I want you to notice your tongue. I want you to pay attention to your tongue. Make sure it's wide and forward. All right, so we've taken some time on that note. We're trying to feel how wide our tongue is. Okay. I'm going to start down here, but I want you to listen. Just play with your tongue and listen to this exercise at first so you can sing along comfortably and you can focus on your tongue instead of the notes. So I'll play it very, very slowly at first. One, two, ready. Remember that mm, mm, keeps the tongue forward, but we also need it wide. Uh, okay, so let's go back to that exercise now that we've heard it a little bit. Keep that in mind and also do the exercise at the same time. I know it's a lot to juggle, but we're going to get there. Do it slow one more time, okay? Here's your note. last little jump that it's okay if that's hard because it is it's hard and that in particular right around that range is where you're gonna feel like your tongue is slipping back a little bit forgive yourself have patience with yourself vowels and the tongue are one part of a package, okay? One part of a duo. And we're going to get into that duo, but first we need to practice paying attention to our tongue. So let's do it again. We're going to do it again. It's going to be a bit faster this time, okay? And I'll give you that tempo, but again, I don't want you to check off a box here. I don't want you to think that just because you're singing and spending time singing that you're going to get better because you have to pay attention. Yes, Singing more will help you get better, but even better than that is paying attention when you sing. So here's your tempo. One, two, three, four. And again, one, two, three, four. One, two, here we go in. Now 
that you know that exercise and you can kind of figure out the notes and you can kind of figure out the purpose of keeping the tongue wide and forward, uh, the next video in this playlist that I'm making, so subscribe if you're not, because if you're new to the channel and you're just watching this, there's another video after it in a playlist that covers all of vowels and it's going to help you a lot. And in that playlist, the next video is just the exercise so we can focus on practicing for like a nice 10 minute chunk uninterrupted.